What's good, this is Trey. In this video, I'm gonna give you some tips and advice on how to attract the women in your life that are right for you, how to attract women that are compatible with you, your way you're living, um, your condition in life, and, and where you, you're going in life, right? So, uh, the first tip I wanna give is, you know, in order to really know what you want in a woman, um, you're gonna have to go and, and interact with a lot of women, go and date a lot of women, like start getting some abundance going. You know what I mean? Don't find yourself just, oh, uh, anytime a woman shows interest, you just put all your energy in her and don't even look, uh, know what you want. You're just going for the first woman that shows up at your doorstep. It's like, no, you know, talk to a lot of women, uh, go on a lot of dates, stop, don't be so picky, right? Because you need to get these experiences to find out what kind of women you really like, what kind of women are right for you. The only way to know that is through experience. Um, the other tip would be, you know, if you have, a, are able to, you know, create a vision of, of the type of girl you want, like maybe you just know, maybe you haven't really had that many experiences with women, but maybe you just know what your dream girl is like. You just know it, right? So write it down, write down exactly what, what is, uh, some of the personality traits she has, you know, what, what kind of condition in life is she, is she, uh, in, you know, what kind of state of mind does she have? You know, how does she look? You know, write these things down because you have the power to attract and manifest exactly what you want into your life. You actually have that power, whether you know it or not, right? But it starts inside. It starts with knowing exactly what you want and not compromising, not not settling, not breaking your standards or, or you know, going against what you really want, right? So you have to get to this point where you know, like specifically, like, if somebody asks you, look, what's, what's your dream girl or what kind of girls you go for? You don't want to you don't want to just be like, oh, I just like girls that look good or whatever, because if you put that intention out there, you will attract that. But you can attract a girl that looks good, but she can have a lot of uh, negative qualities. She could she could have a lot of problems. She could come with a lot of um, just unnecessary baggage that you, you just don't need. Like if you're trying to go forward in life, you don't need someone coming into your life and making shit more difficult than it needs to be, right? Unless that's what you want. Like, if you want a girl that's difficult, that's going to be uh, challenging, some guys like that. They like a girl that's challenging, that's going to come with problems, and they want to see if they can fix it. If that's what you want, that's great. But if that's not what you want, if your goal is to uh, reach your potential in life and be successful and move forward, you want a woman with you, you want to attract women that's going to help you do that, that's going to help you grow, that's going to help you get towards your goal. Right, not women that's gonna slow you down and distract you just cause, just because they're beautiful. Like no, so that's something you wanna think about. Like get specific on exactly what you want, um, and then when you when you're out going out and talking to women and living your life and and um, you know growing and evolving, you know no you know what you want. You know what you want. So then when you get go on these dates with women. You're paying attention. You will see the red flags, right? You will see when she's doing something that goes against your values, that goes against what you seek in a woman. And I'm sure if she's hot enough, if she's beautiful enough, you will be tempted to break your values, to break your standards. And that's where you find out the type of man that you are. Are you going to break your standards and your values for just because she's beautiful? Or are you going to stick? Because that's where, you, that's where you develop character. That's where you develop strength. Is Are you going to do you know, uh, go for exactly what you want or are you going to uh, settle? Are you going to be like, uh, you know what, maybe I'm pushing, maybe I'm being too specific. Maybe I should just, you know, I finally got a girl, you know, let me just get with her. No, because if you get with a girl that is not, does not have the same values as you, does not have the characteristics that you're looking for that's aligned with the way you are and your condition in life, it's going to cause problems down the line, especially when you start to get like um, desensitized to her beauty. Cause after a while, if you're always around her and spending time with her, her beauty is gonna become a normal thing to you and it's not gonna distract you from the red flags anymore, right? So you gotta be able to see them right away and know the type of woman you want and be able to walk away and say, you know what, this isn't the, the type of woman I want in my life. Yes, she's beautiful, but it's just not gonna work out long term. I, I know this and I'm not, I'm not gonna put myself through that bullshit. Right, so you gotta you gotta be aware. And another thing to think about is like, in some you gotta it's a case to case thing, right? So you may find a woman 
that has a lot of the qualities that you like in a woman, but maybe she may have some flaws or some character traits that she's not really rocking with. And you get to be the judge because there are some women who um, may have like the, some, some characteristics that you may not like or may not really want in a woman. But those women are act they're trying to actually overcome those things. And you, she meets you and she sees you as a guy that can help her. You know, it's kind of like, for example, like you may meet a woman that may have like an alcohol problem or maybe she has a smoking problem. And you used to have that problem, but you overcame it. And she now meets you and she likes you and she sees you as the guy who's strong enough to help her overcome that problem. And then you can decide like, you know what, because... You know, if you if you can really do it, if you could really help her, why not? You know, you help her grow. She's going to she's going to be thankful for that. And she's going to, you know, give back to you in a relationship because you're helping her with that challenge. Right. So if it's a what, you know, I'll look at it like this. Like if it's a woman that's trying to grow, that's trying to evolve and she has like maybe some characteristics that I that I'm not that I don't really like or I'm not really rocking with. You know, I look at it and I say, well, if she's willing to grow, I'm willing to help her, right? But if she's not willing to grow, like if she has those characteristics and she's and she's just stuck in them and she's, no, I'm not changing, then I'm going to be like, well, you know what? We're not compatible, you know? And you have to be strong enough to walk away. You have to be strong enough to know that there are other women out there that will have the character traits you're looking for, right? You just got to keep evolving. You got to keep growing. You got to keep talking to different women and you'll you will attract and manifest the right women in your life, right? But um, you got to understand that when you think of something and you know what you want, it takes time for it to manifest physically, right? You can think of something and you can think of it right away. You can, you can, you can think of the, the ideal woman, how she looks, how she acts. You could, you could vision that, but if you, it's not going to be physical right away. You have to, you know... Think of, you know, look at that woman and say, okay, what is, what's the kind of guy that I have to become to attract that woman? You know, what kind of condition in life do I have to create? What type of value do I have to demonstrate to attract that woman? You start moving, you start taking action. And it's not gonna, it's not gonna happen exactly as you think. But if you take action and you believe in yourself and you know what you want and you keep moving towards that goal, at some point it will manifest. You will start seeing signs. You start seeing yourself getting closer to that that ideal woman. You start to see these women uh, come showing up in your life that have these character traits that you always wanted in a woman, and you're like, "Wow, you know, I'm growing, I'm evolving," because I'm starting to see, you know, um, evidence that I'm getting closer to my goal, right? And then once you're there, you gotta be, you gotta be aware. You gotta be like, "Wait, I finally found her," right? And but the only way you'll know. That you found the right girl is by knowing exactly what you want. So when she shows up, you're like, there she is. But if you don't know what you want, you're not sure, you're kind of like, I just want a girl that looks good, then that's what you'll get. You'll get a girl that looks good, but she was going to come with a bunch of shit that you don't want because you didn't get specific and clear on what you want in a woman, right? So I hope this video made sense. Hope it was helpful. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Peace.